Hi, and welcome to another episode of Business Spotlight. I am Teresa Strongmeyer for the Action Coach Champa Bay. Today, we're here with another wonderful business owner in our area. This is Parth Shaw. He's going to come on and tell us a little bit about his business, what he's doing, how long he's been doing it, and we're going to take it from there. So Parth, go ahead and introduce yourself. Tell us about yourself. Uh, hi, so I'm Parth Shah. I'm uh, uh, working with uh, Indus Wincorp LLC. Uh, this is my own company and we are in the business of uh, accounting services. Uh, we provide uh, bookkeeping solutions, payroll solutions and uh, tax preparations and uh, review services to CPA firms. Our uh, basic uh, customer groups are uh, small business owners and uh, CPA firms who are over, uh, overburdened with their work and who are looking for outsourcing their services to other companies right at the lower rates so as we see that uh, in usa it is very difficult to hire train and manage the in-house employees right so that is our basic goal to help such small businesses who are uh, focusing on their business growth uh, cpa firms who are focusing on getting new clients we provide them the support back office solutions so that they can grow their business more powerfully. Wonderful. How long have you been doing this? Uh, we are in the business for last six years, but uh, Indus Fincorp's uh, LLC, right? That has been registered most recently. I have been doing this personally my, with my individual name for last six years. Gotcha. Good deal. What it says... What has been your biggest obstacle over the last couple of years in growing your business? Uh, not the couple of years, but the obstacles started uh, growing this year only, as we are seeing that the market conditions are very bad in U.S. right now. The inflation rate is going high, interest rates are going high, and the uh, uh, terminations of employees are going on, right? So people are uh, going to cut off their excess baggages like uh, in accounting, in uh, other back office supports. And that's where we are lacking to get some new clients. But that is a temporary thing, as we all know. Uh, one day it is going to boom again. So that's not the worry at the moment. And we are at the good momentum. We have a good client base. And okay. uh, we are doing good right now. So no such obstacles right now, but it's just a temporary uh, back backfire. That is fine. Okay. We can manage it. Absolutely. It's a bump in the road and we get these every so often. It's not like it's brand new that we we're going through this. It's just how you get through it because it can either um, make you or break you depending on how you respond to it. So it uh, sounds like you're responding quite well. <laughs> so that's good to hear. So what got you into this business? Uh, see, I was working with a staffing company uh, based in New Jersey uh, for uh, past seven to eight years. I was managing their whole business as an accountant manager. And uh, I was uh, managing their three companies and working with their CPA to file the returns and everything. And that's where the uh, think, uh, thought uh, sparked in my mind that, why not me? Why not my own company, right? So mm -hmm. I started my own practice uh, during that period with the concern of my uh, 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 my employer at that time, right? Mm -hmm. And uh, slowly and gradually, I got some clients, small businesses. So we grew up to this level right now. And now we are focusing on another solution uh, like uh, some people are not comfortable uh, outsourcing their services. So what we do that we provide the accounting persons to that company who will specifically oh. work for them. Right. Oh, so now so you're staffing. We'll be reporting to them, their access and their control will be with the client directly. We will be just the mediator to manage those people, their payroll and everything. That's it. Oh, nice. I love that option. Yeah. So what keeps you motivated? Sorry, uh, can you repeat? What, what keeps you motivated? What keeps you going every day? What inspires you? 
so the changing environment right the change is inevitable i mean and it is a going concern thing right so we need to keep changing our thoughts we need to keep changing our mindsets at every point of time with uh, every 3 three to 4 years passing by right with the mm-hmm. growing technology solutions we need to be uh, keeping up with our current scenarios we need to understand the client needs the obstacles right. client are getting in our services right and we need to provide the best ever solutions to the clients so that they are satisfied with our services so that's keep us motivated that we need to give our best to the clients whatever we have and whatever we gonna have in the future Love it. I actually I absolutely saw and felt your passion as you were saying that. So I know you meant it. So thank you so much for spending time with us today. What um advice would you give to a um someone who's starting off as an entrepreneur? Okay. Uh uh Teresa, your voice broke last minute. Uh, oh, can you okay. just repeat? Sure. What advice would you give to a new business owner, someone starting out? So, uh it is very early time for me to give advice because I am <laughs> in the early stage of my business. But yeah, one thing is for sure that just uh, make sure about your goal. You should be very clear what goal you need to uh, achieve. Uh what is your customer base or client base you are targeting? and according to that you need to get your marketing done and in gotcha. the initial stage the client satisfaction should be the topmost priority of your business i love it i love it well thank you so much for your time if someone wants to reach out to you how will they do that what is your um, what's your contact information uh, uh i have my own linkedin page uh, in the name of the company indus fincorp llc uh you can visit my website as well industfincorp.com and my personal email id is uh, parth p a r t h at industfincorp.com so and i'll have all your information listed under this video so guys thank you so much for watching and we'll see you again next time thanks parth thank you have a nice day